In good health, true inventors can find inspiration just about any place. For one researcher, it started with his favorite beverage. Our Dr. Frank McGeorge is here to show us what this scientist brewed up. Legend has it, it was a falling apple that inspired Sir Isaac Newton to eventually develop his laws of gravity. Perhaps it should come as no surprise then that a modern day researcher could find inspiration in his morning cup of joe. It was an aha moment for Bob Webster. So I've always loved coffee. I have an espresso machine at home and I make coffee every day. If ground coffee can be vacuum packed into a hard brick, could it solve a common problem in ear, nose and throat surgery? Vanderbilt researchers came up with this, a non-invasive way to track how a patient's head moves during surgery. This is two layers of silicon which have been patched together. It looks like a swim cap, but this granular jamming cap is filled with coffee grounds. So beforehand, it's just completely non-rigid. Um, the grains are able to flow just like a liquid um, kind of around the entire skull. What we're going to do is then hook up the vacuum to it. That's the patient sitting there. Pull the vacuum. Now, it's a rock hard surface and it's not gonna move anywhere. And the way that the cap solidifies, it actually conforms into the contours of the skull. Firmly attached reflective markers and an optical scanner set up a surgical GPS display to guide doctors' tools inside the patient. It holds the markers very rigidly on the head so that they can't move. You can move the head all around and those markers go just with the head. Tracking head movements is a problem with the current system, an elastic headband with double stick tape. The skin is mobile, it doesn't stick to the, uh, um, to the skull and so a very slight motion um, can throw us off. A quarter inch can, can be a big difference when you're operating in a really tiny area. With a patent on the technology, the research team moves forward. So the next step is to work with a commercial partner to make it into an FDA approved product. Turning a researcher's favorite drink into something much more. Now in early experiments, the coffee cap reduced imaging errors by up to 83% compared to the headband normally used. All that for about six cups of coffee grounds. Pretty cool. Back to you. It's cool indeed. So clever. Yeah.